Hey everyone! Today we're learning how to make your very own macrame plant hanger at home. First thing you're going to need is some macrame cord. I recommend using um, three millimeter twisted cotton cord. That's what this is. But you can use anything between three and five millimeters, or you could go a little bit um, higher with the size if you want something a little chunkier. Um, and then you're going to want some measuring tape. I just use my hardware measuring tape, but you can use craft measuring tape, whatever, it's all the same. Um, and a wooden ring. So these are available in our kits, and I'll link down below if you want to buy them on their own to, on Amazon. Good pair of scissors, and you're going to want to cut all your strings. So in our kits, it comes pre-cut already, but you can, if you're using your own supplies, you're going to need four 12-foot strings, four eight-foot strings, and two five-foot strings. First you want to put all eight-foot and twelve-foot strings on your ring. Then you're going to do the barrel knot and fold your five-foot string. One side of the string two to three times longer than the other. Now you want to put your string against the others with the loop side up and wrap the longer side around all of your strings. Make sure to wrap very tightly. Now you want to pull the end of the string through the loop at the top. Grab both ends of the string and pull really tight. Now you're going to cut the ends of the string so they aren't visible. Now you want to take four strings, two short and two long. Check in the bottom to make sure that you have two short ones and two long ones. You're going to make a simple knot. Now the knot needs to be about six inches down from the barrel knot. And you're going to make a loophole with all four strings, like this. Pull the ends of the string through the hole. You will want to tighten your strings, making sure that the knot is six inches down. Repeat this process until you have four simple knots, making sure that each knot has two short and two long strings. Now we will begin the spiral knots. Keeping the two shorter strings in the middle, fold your figure four with the right string and it goes under the two middle strings and over the left. The left then goes over the two middle strings and through the loop on the right. Tighten your knot and repeat. You're going to want to do this about 30 knots to make a 6 inch long spiral knot. Once you're finished all four, you're going to make a simple knot at the bottom of the spiral knots. 
repeat on each arm. Now you're going to make another simple knot about six inches below the other ones. Now taking two strands you're going to want to make sure they're not jumbled at the top and they're side by side. We're going to go about two inches down and take two strings from each and make a square knot. So right strand goes under the two middle and over the left and then the left strand goes over the two middle and through the loop on the right just like before. Pull tight and do the opposite. Left string under the middle and over the right. Right string over the middle and through the loop. Pull tight and then you have a square knot. Repeat twice to have two full square knots. You're going to repeat this process three times so you have a total of four square knots. Now you're going to make another row of square knots just like before. The end result should be net-like. Now gather your strings for the last knot and this is the perfect time to test your pot in your hanger just to see that everything fits and where you want your last knot to be. You're going to make a barrel knot with the last five foot string, make sure one side is longer than the other, and wrap the long end around all of the strings. Pull the end of the string through the loop and tighten. Now cut the ends and you're finished.